Locris, land of salt. And Locris, more salt. Land of salt. And more salt. Is this lake full of blood? Wonder what's made it so red. <laughs> 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 
I need to talk to him. A camp. Gorgias must be nearby. He must be the one Pythagoras man. The lair of the Sphinx. Impressive. Oh my, Amistios. What are you doing here? My name is Gorgias, and I have spent my life researching the past of Viotia and the Peloponnese. I'm looking for the other half of this amulet. Ah, yes, I know of items like this. I was seeking a piece similar in size. Where is it? Unfortunately, my apprentice was the one tracking down its final location in Locris. He went to retrieve it, but never returned. I'll find your apprentice and recover the amulet piece without any trouble at all. Thank you. The gods have truly blessed me by sending you to help find Pibos. Don't worry. I'll find out what happened to Pibos. over there.
This must be Pibos, or what's left of him. These pieces fit together perfectly. This must be the key. Statue. It's gone. It must only work at night. I should come back after dark.
must only work at night. I should come back after dark. must only work at night. I should come back after dark. must only work at night. I should come back after dark. Can I help you with something? The midwife from the village usually comes for plants I grow for her farmica, but she's very late. Do you think something has happened to her? I hope not, but she usually comes up through the barley field. I did see a wolf running through there the other day. Sounds like you want me to kill the wolf. That's right. It can't live. I'll take care of it. Good. I need it done quick. I'll come back when I'm done.
Theos. Has the beast been slain? The beast is dead. Good work. Here, you've earned this. I always finish what I've started. Thank the gods you're here. A hunting party has been attacked outside the city, near the cursed land of Oedipus. Any survivors? This man saw dead bodies, but he could still hear screaming. There are many dangerous beasts out in the wild. If someone is injured, they won't last long. I need you to go and rescue whoever is still alive, and put an end to the dangerous beast that attacked them. All right, I'll destroy the beast and see if anyone's still in one piece. If they are, bring them back to me, and I'll do what I can to save them. I'll go and find the trail. <laughs> Vivians. Cowards that surrender to Xerxes. The fuck? <laughs>
Must be what's left of the hunting party. Excuse me off. I feel faint. I'm I need easy. to get him back to Hippocrates before he bleeds out all over me. the patient he'll survive if I treat his injuries if this man is a monster he's a slave trader who treats people so terribly that they injure themselves just to avoid working for him <sighs> if I help him he'll continue to hurt others but if I choose to do nothing many will be spared pain and suffering It shouldn't matter what this man has done. He deserves to be treated like anyone else. We can't judge others when they're at our mercy. I know it's my duty to help this man, but if you'd seen some of the injuries I've treated that he's caused, you would understand my doubts. The innocents of the Greek world have suffered enough lately. What if I free his slaves? If he has no slaves, he can't mistreat them anymore, and you'll be able to treat him without guilt. Yes, I can save this man. And you can prevent him from hurting others. 
Our kindness here will show him the error of his ways, show him a different path to walk. You would do this for me? Of course I'll free the slaves for you. Thank you, my friend. If the slaves are in danger, I will need to hurry. I see him. I need to talk to her. I see him. here.
that strange? Nothing at all. The archer is over there! I see where they fired from. By Hermes, I'm free at last. My thanks.
Missä tiste is? Kuka oli teistä tutoistiin? You have given me my freedom. How can I ever repay you? Thank you for freeing us. That beast Galeos has worked us all to the brink of death. Now I can return home to my family. I freed the slaves. 
I've treated his injuries enough to... I don't know if I can bring myself to complete the treatment. So you're just going to stand here and watch this man die? You need to do what you do best and heal him. It's what the gods put you here to do. Help people, not judge them. If I do nothing, I'll be no better than him. I'll make sure he recovers. When he does, be sure to tell him how his life was in our hands. Only the gods have the power to decide life and death. What I do is... I've seen you save many from a trip down the Styx. But look at the plague. For all my knowledge and experience, I could do nothing against it. I have to accept that my reach only goes so far. Thank you for... I must go. I have an appointment with a patient elsewhere.
Must only work at night. I should come back after dark. Another challenger. I hope you're more resilient than the last one. By the gods! This statue came alive! I am no statue, child. If you cannot comprehend what stands before you, how are you to entertain me? I came here for another reason. Oh, then tell me, little one, why are you here? I've come to end you, and take your power. Many before you have tried. All have failed. I won't. While it would amuse me to see you try, harming me will not give you what you seek. The only way to acquire the power I possess is to impress me with your mind. Sounds simple enough. If you are correct, I will surrender that which I guard. If you are wrong, I shall end you. I create my lair with earth and string and dispatch my prey with a biting sting. A spider. Good thinking, little one. At night they come without being fetched, and by day they are lost without being stolen. The stars. You're a wise one. Some try to hide, some try to cheat, but time will show we always will meet. Try as you might to guess my name. I promise you'll know when you I do claim.
death. Well done, mortal. You are an interesting one. Now, take what you have learned and touch the symbols that reflect your choices.
life is already over. Hippocrates, you know it's unwise to upset a patient. He asks me to end his life when he knows I can't. Messias, please help me. I'm in such terrible pain. You cannot simply ask someone to kill you in my presence. I'm your physician. I will not allow it. I can ease your pain, analyze your symptoms, and try to cure you. But that's all. Pain is just part of being mortal. It reminds us that we're alive and keeps us sharp. I have known many pains in my life. My own suffering is what I worry about right now, but making sure my family's future is secured. Secured how? My family is one of the richest in Thebes, and we have many rivals. When I die, my son will become the head of our house. Ah, uh, uh, he's just a boy. Ah. Uh. Uh, I need to ensure they can't take advantage of my death. I'll deal with your rivals and give your son a fighting chance. Thank you, Mystias. If you steal their assets, it will weaken their position and prevent them from posing a threat to my family. That will buy my son time. Stealing isn't normally what I'm paid for, but... I'll get it done. If doing this helps bring him some semblance of peace, I will pray for Tiki to watch over you. Anything. They're not here. We don't stop until they're found. If they were still here, we would have seen them by now. What the... What did you see? All clear as far as I can tell. Keep at it! This archer has to fly! Report any sightings! Nothing! They can't have gotten far. Stay alert! As you go! Take cover!
That should be everything worth taking. I've done what you asked. Your family's position will be secure for quite some time. You have given me hope that my name will live on long after I'm gone. All I can ask the gods for now is that my son lives a longer and happier life than I. I'm in your debt. You don't owe me a thing, really. Now, it pains me to ask, but I need your help with one more thing. I know what you want to ask. This disease will claim me, be it today or another in the future. It's a matter of when, not if. Hippocrates won't just let me kill you. No, but he listened to you. If you can convince him it's what's best for me, he might change his mind. I don't want to slowly waste away. I want to die in peace while my family remembers me in a good light. I'll talk to him for you. I appreciate your help. You've shown me more kindness in the last few days than most have my entire life. Now I must rest. If you have a moment, I would... He seems to be resting peacefully now. Yes, you helped ease his mind, but he'll never truly be at peace until he takes his last breath. When will that be? It's hard to tell. Judging by his symptoms, it'll be sooner rather than later. 
I can lessen his pain, but to do so, I'd need some hemlock. I'll collect the ingredients you need. Thank you. It won't stop the pain entirely, but I hope it'll help him feel more comfortable. He doesn't want to feel better. He wants to die with some dignity. True dignity would be fighting through this, so I can analyze his symptoms further. He wants to die, and he's in pain. You should respect his right to choose, instead of treating him like an experiment. What you're doing is wrong. I will not be lectured on the morality of my work by a sellsword. I have a responsibility, like all healers, to use my knowledge for the betterment of others. I'll get the hemlock you need. 